Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm here to do a test ride of this beauty. This is the 2017 edition of the RC390. So I have already ridden the 2016 edition of the RC390, but I I was just curious what the changes the KTM has done to the bike. That's the reason I am here to do the test ride of the video. Uh, sorry, test ride of the bike. Sorry. And this bike belongs to my that friend Akshay. He has he also have a YouTube channel uh, called Journey Matters. I will provide the link in the description box. So uh, nothing has changed in the bike uh, except the visual graphics of the bike. The paint scheme has also changed. Okay, let's hop on the bike. The first thing you will notice after starting the bike is exhaust note. The exhaust note have already changed. Now the exhaust note is kind of a throaty air. The throttle response of the bike has increased, all thanks to the ride by wire throttle. In old version, it used to get the 300 mm disc at the front. Now it's getting the 320 mm, so braking also improves. And it should be because because of the BS4 engine, the bike has gained some weight. So to cope up with that, the KTM has uh, increased the 0.5 horses in the bike and also 1 Nm of torque is increased. There is no lack in the performance of the bike because all thanks to the ride by throttle, it has improved the quickness, initial pickup of the bike you can say. Brake is also provide a great feedback, all thanks to the 320mm front disc. Let's check. Turning radius of bike. Okay, so because of the increase in the weight, you will feel that weight while turning the bike. Okay, the bike feels uh, as same excited as earlier. The side mounted exhaust act very great but it has just disturbed the mass centralization of the bike. And if you talk about the vibrations of the bike, the I felt the vibration is kind of minimum as compared to previous. I guess it is because of the side mounted exhaust and uh, bs4 engine maybe i wish i could fly the bike on the highways because i just wanted to do that <laughs> i just wanted to ride the bike on the highway because uh, that's the place where it's it can show its uh, true potential and now i guess the KTM also improved the cooling system of the bike so I'm riding it since 15 to 20 minutes radiator fan not started yet so that's a nice thing and all right that's the changes the KTM has done to the bike not much changes have been done and the suspension system also as same as earlier so now the KTM has also changed the lever of the bike so now it gets the adjustable clutch and the, also the brake lever as you can see they can be adjusted according to your size of the finger
okay so that's the small small changes done by the ktm uh, it's time to end the video over here i hope you like my today's video and if you like then do like share and also subscribe to my channel and also ch subscribe to my friend's channel i will provide the link in the description